welcome. In this video, we're in the Piper PA46 in Flight Sim World. I'm going to demonstrate how to use the data entry pad, which is located right here, to enter your altitude and vertical speed for autopilot. Currently, we're on a heading of approximately 180, whatever, at an altitude of 10,000 feet. First thing we want to do, we want to enter a higher altitude. So on the data entry pad, zoom in so you can see it, we're going to click on ALT and then data. You have to do this to enter anything. Then on this wheel, we scroll up to set our new altitude. I'm going to set it to 20,500 feet. I'm at 20,000. To switch it to 100, you click on it, and then it will go in hundreds. Click again, and it's thousands. Click the data pad, and now my new altitude is 20,500 feet, and I'm going to start a climb at whatever the default climb rate is. But we don't want to use the default climb rate. We want to climb faster. So we enter a vertical speed. We click on VS, press the data button, and scroll this up to increase in increments of 100 feet per minute. We're going to set it at 1,000, which is 10 plus 10, 1,000 feet. And we are now going to start climbing at 1,000 feet per minute. Voila! That's it for how to use the data entry pad to enter altitude and vertical speed for autopilot. I know some folks try to use this VS button to set the vertical speed, but it doesn't always work for me. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Using this data entry pad, every time, 100% of the time, never have a problem. In order to descend to the specific rate, you would just hit the VS key, data, and then drop it to a negative number, and it will set a descent rate. And then it will set your altitude accordingly. That's it. Hope you enjoy this. Hope you can use it.